In the midst of a tense Senate investigation, the spotlight fell squarely on suspended Bam Bam Mayor Alice Gua, whose absence from proceedings drew sharp warnings and legal threats. Senate President Chiz Escudero, flanked by Senator Risa Hontiveros, affirmed their stance during a press conference that Gua must face the Senate scrutiny. Escudero, firm in his resolve, declared he would authorize an arrest warrant if Hontiveros formally requested it. It is in the hands of Senator Risa whether she will request the issuance of a warrant of arrest to compel them to attend the Senate hearing, and I will sign that warrant of arrest if Senator Risa requests it," he asserted. The Senate's inquiry focused on the alleged illegal operations of a Philippine offshore gaming hub in Bamban, an issue exacerbating by Gua's purported involvement. Despite a recent charge of qualified human trafficking, Gua did not appear at the latest Senate hearing, citing health concerns through her legal counsel. This absence prompted Hontiveros to issue a subpoena, an action yet to reach Gua as she remained elusive, reportedly only leaving her farm helper behind in Bam Bam. Escudero criticized Gua's legal maneuvering, stressing that compliance with a subpoena is mandatory under the law. It is not up to them to decide whether or not to attend the next hearing, he emphasized, clarifying that a valid medical certificate would be required to justify any absence due to health reasons. Meanwhile, Gua's lawyer hinted that she might skip future hearings due to emotional distress caused by her previous interactions with the Senate committee. This suggestion drew rebuke from Hontiveros, who dismissed any attempt to evade accountability, particularly from a public servant. The unfolding drama surrounding Gua included discrepancies in her identity and nationality, revealed during her earlier testimony under oath. Allegations surfaced that she misrepresented her background, prompting deeper scrutiny into her eligibility to hold public office. We merely asked basic questions that any upright human being could answer. Now that she has no excuse, she is playing the victim, Antiveros remarked pointedly, underscoring the necessity for Gua's presence at the upcoming proceedings to forestall further complications. With the next hearing looming, tensions remained high as Senate leaders and legal representatives braced for a potential standoff over Gua's mandated appearance, setting the stage for a crucial chapter in the ongoing investigation.